Hi, Jake Middleton here from CAD Micro Solutions. Today I want to talk to you about how to add dimensions to a bomb. Now this is actually a pretty easy thing to do and it looks really nice. You can basically link dimensions right out of the parts and have it on your drawing bill of materials. So this is a nice little uh, gripper arm that I created. Uh, and I want to show you how to link uh, all the dimensions uh, into your bill material. So it's quite easy. Just open up a part, go to your file properties, and under your custom, simply type in any name. You can type in length or whatever you want. Now you type in the equal sign, click on the part, and click on the dimension you want. And it'll put in this formula for you. I like to go and delete the equal sign afterwards. Then you just get the nice uh, value of the dimension itself. You can also copy that uh, property right there, just a control C. And then when you go into another part, open it up and go to its file properties, you can click on the number one and do control V to paste it. So it pastes in that exact property. This helps so that way you know that it's named uh, the exact same way, which is important. And again, simply click on the part and the dimension and you'll see it'll link that to the new uh, part. So basically we're just creating little names here, length in this case, but it really could be anything as long as they're all named the same thing. Then you go into your uh, bill of materials and you see that the length column is already filled out with all of the custom property dimension values that we linked. Now to actually add this uh, in uh, to your bill of materials, very easy, simply right click, go to insert, column to the right. It'll put a new blank column there for us. We choose custom property, and we choose the name that we put in, in our case, length. But you really could have called it anything. And it's gonna go and gather up all of those values uh, for the lengths, and those are, of course, all parametric, which will change with the part. I'm Jake Middleton, thanks for watching.